Hello guys, it's me Carzet, the thank you for coming back, and welcome to a new game that I haven't done in a while. Why did I say new game? Oh well, let's move on. It is called MotoGP 22, so it's an Xbox Game Pass game, and I'm just gonna do like a uh, story mode, which is 9 seasons 2009, so... It's based off the 2009 game where Valentino Rossi, Danny Pedrosa, Jorge Lorenzo, and I forgot the fourth one, but oh well, let's see this quick cutscene. The Valentino Rossi is the greatest motorcycle racer of all time. Oh, Casey Stoner, yeah. <laughs> Yep, those four main drivers are like the main characters in this story mode. So. An injury. Yep. While Nicky Hayden is on a roll, racking up victories, podiums, and points, taking the contest all the way to the final race in Valencia. Yeah, it's gonna be like five minutes long, but. You're not gonna see me commentate my gameplay footage at. Qatar, which is in Lozale, I believe. Loser. Yeah. It's a race circuit that F1 that used to race a few years ago back back then, so. But they don't race no more because I younger, believe it's because of faster, COVID. So. Like yeah, F1 had to race at all kinds of tracks that, that they usually had in F1 2019, 2020, before the pandemic set the Anyways, it's just how the schedule went compared to MotoGP and uh, other racing series. So, all I can say is, I really enjoy international racing series, which is basically what NASCAR drivers are hoping, but yeah, they, they stick to NASCAR. Because it's like the safest series going around the circles and just knowing that it's the best series. So, so I'll end my commentary here. If I found the button, if you like the video so much, share a comment right below the description so you can share some positive feelings with everybody in the community and make them feel welcome. And click on that bell notification button so you can get future videos from my YouTube channel, Happy Carlo 95. So, I'm Happy Carlo 95. Peace out. And then he crashes. And crashes. And crashes. and puts himself in hospital. But Casey Stoner is still there. After some teething trouble with the 2008 Ducati, the reigning world champion is going faster than ever. A three-win blitz in mid-season, blocking Rossi's title charge. Time to fight back. Laguna Seca. A duel in the California sun. As close to a fist fight as you can get on a motorcycle. Some of the passing maneuvers were maybe a little bit too much and past the point of fair or aggressive. We make a lot of overtaking, uh, quite aggressive, but uh, we never touch each other. My style to race is try to never give up. Anyway, I enjoy the battle. Stoner and his team don't like it but everybody else does. The Australian falters. Two crashes at Bruno and Mizano. And worse, a wrist injury. Rossi is relentless. He wins six of the remaining eight races. Stoner, two. The Italian is king again and making history. Only one rider that other Italian god, Giacomo Agostini, has ever recaptured the crown after losing it two years in a row. Agostini managed it once in 1975. 
but he finished seventh the following season and retired the year after that. In 2009, Valentino Rossi sets out to win it again. A new record in his sights and no thoughts of retirement in his head. There are only three problems. Jorge Lorenzo, Casey Stoner, and Danny Pedrosa. Lorenzo slips back to fifth behind Caparossi and Davizioso. He knows he can go faster. It's a confidence thing. Under new rules, the bikes are now all on Bridgestone tires. Rossi and Stoner were already on Bridgestone in 2008, but Lorenzo was on Michelin. The Spaniard is still getting used to the Bridgestones. They behave a little differently at the limit, and it's a knife edge where the rubber meets the road. Stoner and Valentino. They are a little bit stronger than us. They are uh, more experienced with, uh, with the Brixton tire, and we are uh, still uh, improving. But now's no time to play it safe. Fifth place is not okay. This is not going to plan. Fourth on lap two, fifth on lap three. Get past Caparossi and Vizioso. You need that podium.
So I'm coming to the end of my YouTube video right now, so give a thumbs up button if you like the video so much. Click on that bell button to subscribe for more content and if you saw the recent video interesting, share the comment right below the description so you can share some thoughts and feelings with everybody in the community and make them feel welcome. So I make a happy Corona 95. So have a great day and peace out.